Hey folks, this is Decoherent, and welcome back to RimWorld. So, many things to redo today. First of all, I'm redesigning all of this. So here's what's going to happen. So what I'm essentially doing is I am, well the storage isn't changing quite yet, but I'm moving my kitchen from here up to here. I should not have put in the flooring, so that makes that hard to see. This is going to be the little butchering room back there. Uh, the door can just stay open, it doesn't matter. Um, I'm actually setting up a little room here to do the cooking in. They also won't get the debuff from working in the cold and then they will be happy. So that's good. And then what's going to happen over here? This is going to be a dining room, hence the dots. Um, this area is going to be split between a rec room and I want to get rid of these two bedrooms so that this can all be the big laboratory. That I think they're, I think they're actually going up here. I think this is about the best I can do. Um, obviously I don't want to dig into the mountain. I don't really want to come out any further here until I've got better places to grow. Like this is already, yeah, it, it would it would overlap too much stuff. So we're going to kind of hold off on that. And I think this will be fine. I could even add, no, I can't add a third bedroom because this is under mountain. So there's that. So I have taken out some mods. I really wanted to, and I hadn't talked about this, mix stargates. But unfortunately, they are not going to work with this mod set. My plan would be to actually start a second colony, which would be awesome, and then link them with gates. But that's not going to work. I can't jump into these two new concepts all on their own, so yeah. Well, let me see here. Glovine, yep. Villa Hospital, yep. Oh, look at all the mutations. So these are all kind of funny. Um, if I can bring you up here. Pig morph, yeah. So these have various, like, I don't know standing on his nails. Um, Grange can never get food sickness, which is pretty cool. Um, the problem here is this snout. That's why it's saying like, oh, he can't talk well. You should might want to use another you know, person. Well, whatever. He's at 90% and that's good enough. As soon as we get Joanne recruited, Joanne is social two stars at 10.9 uh, already. So they will be taking over all that stuff. And then once I have laboratories built up, then I can go ahead and I can split because we are going to have two factions. I really hope I get another scientist because I need one. Because what I want to do is I want to divide my scientists into two, not really competing, but sort of competing classes. First, we're going to have the scientists that are carefully working along the way, extracting serums, doing experiments, you know, careful work. And then once they have an understanding of what it is they have, then they can use that to implement strategies and upgrade people and paths and so on and so forth. The other side just says, we're in an emergency situation. We just need to throw some science against the wall and see what happens. And they've got a bunch of mutagens and they go, we just throw them all over the place. I think that will work pretty well. And it sounds really funny to me in my head. So we'll find out. And that is it. I just need to do some spell checking. I switched over to auto doors because I'm really tired of it taking so long to move around the base. I don't think this fire is going to go out because it would need rain to put out the fire and it can't rain because it's foggy. So I think the entire map might burn to the ground, which is hilarious in its own special way. So, um, I mean, it is problematic because I need these trees. I guess I could cut a fire break, but we'll see. We'll see. We'll, we'll see what happens. I shifted priorities one more time here just temporarily just to bring both Morton Gordon up on their construction because I need this stuff fixed sooner rather than later. And are we good on that? Battery's broken. That's not good. Good old Tanya. What's your mining at? 7.6. That's respectable. It's going to get a lot higher than that before too much longer. Thank you, Mort. Oh, and this is for the wood floors. And the mining that I'm doing to expand things is not critical. So, you know, whenever someone gets to it, it's fine. And I think that's about it for the moment. A party. Good. Very good. I want to keep you guys cheerful. The best we can do. It's going to be great when we have a rec room and you're not kind of hanging out in a slightly dirty lab whatever new lovers oh thank god kendra and Corden. all right here so let me start my relationship relationships so i have kendra 
um, plus condent. All right, this is good. This is very good because that saves me a bedroom. Um, unowned. Huh. That's interesting. Poor. Yeah. Let's take that apart. And since I don't have any reliable amount of wood, I guess we'll just make you a steel double wood for right now. Can I afford the cool furniture yet? No, and I haven't even researched most of it yet. Crap. Well, man, there's not much I can do. Where are my double beds? And single beds? That's not good. Um, here, hold on just a second. Let me fix this. So I don't know what's going on with my furniture and I'm not gonna fix that right now. So obsidian double bed, Jesus. So I just kind of randomly dev mode one in here and we'll install this and then move it around. Well, that's a hassle because that is not, that is not correct. It's missing all of the vanilla stuff, isn't it? Well, not all of it, huh? Well, that should be interesting. Oh, geez, I can't even put them in the same bed because Kendra's ideology prevents sleeping together when you're not married. <sighs> Conversion, yay! All right. That will save us a lot of effort a little bit later. Now, recruit. This won't take long. Yeah, it was just since of 0.9, so no big deal. Just getting some floors in here. Yeah, I know we don't have the wood yet. It'll get there, or lights, or anything like that. We'll get there. There, that'll look perfect. Got some trees getting cut down over here. I'm gonna have to ask you to ignore this giant semicircle of mystery, but the fire's gone, so that's good, you know. And you, what's wrong with you? Chemical hunger, ready apparel. I don't know if I wanna desocialize you right away. I really could use someone to work on plants though. Let's switch you over to transform. <laughs> Not yet. Just what? Resist resistance? Oh, I'm sorry, resistance. Let's get that down to zero and then I'll kind of make a decision whether or not I want to recruit them or not. Okay, hold on. A raid. Multiple directions. Oh, this is not good. This is not good at all because I forgot to make a bunch of weapons for my people. So we are not well equipped. Um. Oops. Yeah, not good. Not good at all. Go put on hats if you need to. Nope, never mind, never mind. Whoa, hold on, whoa, <laughs> Jesus. Never mind, I've changed my mind. Go over to your defensive positions. Holy God, these guys are coming in hot. I guess they don't have very far to go. Come on, guys. Okay, that group's gone. Done. Very good. What'd you turn them into? A monkey? <laughs> That's funny. Kendra, don't you have a defensive position? Apparently not. Come here. You're not a great shot, but you're better than nothing. 
Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, get over here. Okay, this is now your defensive position. Now, do I have time to let everyone go get helmets on? Not really. Um, maybe you guys are fine for the moment. Ooh, I might want you, we'll see. Hmm, okay. Here's the problem with melee. You can disarm them? Oh, that's cool. Okay. Oh, well, nice work, team. Um, I'm actually fairly impressed. So. <laughs> oh. That's too bad. We're gonna kill you. Okay, so what do we have here for prisoners? Oh, you're never gonna last long enough. Um. Seven hours. You are tempting. You suck at construction and mining, but with a single fire, boy, would that go up fast. Let's tentatively rescue you. Oh my god. Now you've got a whole bunch of mutagenic buildup, so I don't think I want you. I think I want you two though. Oh, am I really out of beds already? <laughs> um, this can become a prisoner bed, that's fine. We've got the space for it. Okay, and what's our injury report look like? You're missing a leg. Great. And I can't do like leg transplants, unfortunately. Just a stab, some bruises. It's a good thing that I researched prosthetics already. Tanya. All you have is some bruises. Okay, hold on. We'll deal with that in a couple minutes. I could really use a backup doctor, you know. Kill him. Okay. The dusty insulation. Yeah. Those are not going to be coming along for quite a while here. Crap. Oh, now you can walk. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Ah, uh, it's better than nothing. Actually, because this is plus 25%, this isn't actually all that bad. So I'm not gonna stress about you. I'm gonna stress about everybody else. We're not, you can wear your regular clothes, guys. Okay. And we'll transport crash. What are you? A Mamie, that's new. The Chimera was a monstrous fire-breathing hybrid creature of Lycia in Asia Minor, composed of the parts of a lion with the head of a goat protruding from its back and a tail that ends in a snake's head. Chimeras aren't naturally occurring creatures and were created as part of the Hectate Project, a bioengineering program that was of using applied mechanite replicators to already existing animals to mutate them into magical creatures. So chimeras are slightly venomous and fire-breathing, making them quite dangerous. 
only to their enemies, they love wooden colonies. Awesome. How can I go about rescuing you? Okay, you're actually not that bad at the moment, so why don't you come rescue? Oh, you have a mangled eye. That's, that's great. Well, I haven't researched that yet, so. Okay, so how are things going around here? Besides absolutely filthy, which is a really big problem. Crisis of belief. Ooh, nice. Well, who's my warden? Oh, Grange. Um, Condent, bad news. I need you to do that as well. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, yes, do that. So Spider is going to die probably. Grange? Hi. Grange is not. In fact... Where'd you wander in from? Oh, down here. Eh, you're boned. Oh, you had a low shield pack too. A burnout low shield. What does that mean? Oh, just another name? Keep it going, buddy. Wow. Nicely done, my friend. Way to escape the death zone. Okay, anyway. Back to our colony. And we're running out of power. Because there is no wind at the moment. Remember that wood generator that I had that I took apart? Yeah, I remember. Oh, now you've decided to fight. Now you're dead. Scarification. Itchy. You actually put some damage on this inadvertently. Actually, the turrets are... In fact, they might actually destroy it themselves. Okay, hold on. I need to see what's going on up here. Um... Well, we need some more power. So... I can build it... without doing anything by just putting it, like, right here. And then just running some power cables over. And that will be good enough for right now. Ah, you kill them. 58! They brought it down to 58! Just by, like, randomly shooting at each other. And I'd better bring you on side. Shouldn't make any real difference. Man, this is too bad. I wanted this guy. Oh, it's close, too. Ah, oh, man. But if I flipped him over to proper medicine, he might have made it. Yep. You started a fight? What? Why? A brigand. Okay. Well, I understand that completely. That's just rude. That's cool that you can disarm people in, like, melee combat. Wait. Oh, it's because my grid is no longer connected. Ha ha ha. I knew that. So I don't actually need power. But it's okay. I've already gone this far, so... I'll just finish this up. Yep. Jeez, guys. This is not the right time, Tanya, because you are my doctor. <laughs> oh, man. This is so disappointingly close, too. Whoa. Oh, hi. The Lancers are inside. Um... Whoops. I did not expect that. I didn't realize they were going to come all the way up here. Kendra's largely useless, unfortunately. 
Here, go bother that one. Uh oh. Here, Tanya, rescue. Come on, guys. Okay. Christ. Rescue. Rescue. Um, can you build this stuff quick so I have power again? Crap. Yep, bye-bye. Well, we tried. Okay, do I have anyone? Who's my backup doctor? I guess it's Condon. Yeah, you're going back on self-heal. Oh, well. Thank you, Mort. Mort, can you do me a favor and come do some cleaning? That really sucks that Grange got nailed again because Grange is my cook and we're out of food. So I need you to come cook. I know it's gonna suck. I can't believe they ran all the way up here. Like that's kind of impressive. Actually, you know what? This door can stay open for the moment. Hey, Joanne joined us. Thank God. Okay, good. Hi. <laughs> um, I'm gonna have to have someone help me fix this because like everything is gone. I can't even spawn in like the over the wall vents. They just freak out. So I can't move them. So yeah, that's uh. That's not a happy state of affairs, that's for sure. All right, Joanne, what am I gonna have you do? Y you, you know what, let's do something like this. That'll be fine for the moment. Oh, the rescued animals joined us! <gasps> Yay! And are you the animal person? Yes, you are! Oh, this is a good day. Let's just get guard back on these guys. Now that I have someone who can actually, like, train them. And I do need all this food brought inside, please. Mostly because I want it out of the way. Here, let's unforbid all this stuff up here. We may actually pull this off. Um, allow selection. I always look for unforbid. Like, there's something different about why unforbid is the same thing, but it's not. And here, let's put mechanite corpses in here. Just so they're kind of out of the way. We'll take them apart in a few minutes here. We got we got other stuff to catch up with. Remaking vests, remaking pants, so on and so forth. How are you doing? You're doing okay. Kendra's back up. Good, good. I'm just assuming that you're going to go find your weapon again. Excellent. Having someone at number one on cleaning is really nice. It's really nice. And let's see here. I need some trees. All right. Are we doing well enough to have our ceremony? The dutiful party. Sure. No, I don't want this to be you. Oh, well, that's because this is from a different ideology. Well, you know what? Um. Sure. Well, that looks cool.
Ooh. Nice, it was beautiful. We have friendly visitors. Hooray. And I need a place to keep my animals that is not indoors, obviously, because they're making a mess. Not okay. You know what? I could put them in a little area right here. Could move this door up here. Mm hmm. And then we still have some sandstone. And I can still use sandstone, apparently, so that's good. <sighs> I wish I knew what was going on. Wait, you guys both get a beautiful, like, a dutiful party? Really? No. No, not at all. Wait, another animal pod? What are you? A farm bird. No, I don't I don't want to check in. No, thank you. That's too much work. I know that I like micro, but I don't like it quite that much. A gift. Glitter World Medicine. Well, thanks for stopping by. Okay, so this is Rift and everything, right? Yep. Okay, I just needed you guys outside. I'm not really sure what to do with you guys, to be honest, but... We'll figure something out. Hey, auto doors. At long last. That's been a long time. Um, prosthetics. I've already got basic prosthetics. That's probably good enough. Um... I think we're doing ge responsible genetic research. Doesn't sound like me, does it? No, this is what I want. Targeted serums. Yes. I'm actually really glad I don't have to, like, build that, um... Build the prosthetic stuff and everything. Like, that's actually really quite nice. Targeted serums. Using some more advanced techniques, I can now target two distinct types of mutation, production and combat. Production can be used to make pawns more useful, allowing them to produce milk, eggs, and other items. Yeah. Yeah. I don't even have a lab yet. Um, we're gonna need to make an eye for our buddy over there, so... Actually, we can't. Not unless we go to Bionics, and I can't. <sighs> Alright. Alright. Um... Let's do Fire Foam before something really bad happens. Fire Foam, good deal. Um, did we do the malt analyzer yet? Looks like we got partway through it. Let's do that. I'm almost ready here to start spreading things out so I can make all these different rooms. It's just taking a while. And I don't know what floor this is. This just says marble large tile. But, oh cool. But I don't have anything called large tile. I was trying staggered just to see what that looked like. Looks like I put in here? No. I honestly don't know. Hmm. And, uh, Silink. Okay, so. Do we go up or do we improve you? See, this just give me batteries, and I don't care about batteries. Yes, ball lightning would be awesome. Static pulse would be cool. Vortex. I think I'm gonna upgrade you. And now, you're better. Yes. Perfect. And I need to find a way for fatigue to eat my meals again. I increased the amount of food on that, so hopefully it will work okay. And nobody will starve, maybe? 
Well, this is the wrong flooring, but it's what I've got. Solar flare, that's fine. Animal filth. Yeah, it's because you're writing them inside, which is mildly irritating. Um, we can go ahead and we can just throw a couple passive coolers in here. That's fine. That'll keep things under control. Um, and let's go ahead and let's move some people over here. I mean, these two beds are the ones that are going away, so let's just move them. Or the two rooms, rather. So I can move that one out. Okay. This is a little more annoying. I'm gonna have to turn this back into a prisoner bed. And take this and reinstall it up here in this slightly smaller room because I ran out of space. There's Overhead Mountain. There you go. And I was keeping this beautiful statue in there too. So I can reinstall these. So I need to be careful about never ever taking them apart or else. And people made these. Okay, is that making it any colder in there? Um, no. Is this at least refrigerated? Um, no. Well, I tried. Oh no! You failed. Even though your plants are at seven. Mutagenic buildup. Ah, crap. Please be careful. Son of a... Okay, Kendra? That's not good. Yeah, why don't you go harvest heal rod or something a little safer? There we go. Power's back on. Same with the dartboards. I can't make more of them. So, at least I have one. So, this is slightly better. Make sure this is the party spot now. What am I going to do with this area down here? That's probably going to turn get turned into part of the lab. Is what I'm thinking. Yeah, something like that. Ooh, Psychic Sue, that's nice. Okay, let's reinstall this over here. If we can. Okay, you can. Good. Okay, workers. Nope. Actually. No, I want to take this because I want more people to get Psy abilities. Okay. So... Who could I lose for a couple of seasons? I could probably live without Tanya. As stupid as that sounds, given that they're a good doctor. How long did it say it was going to be? Oh, seven days. Okay, no problem. So then, who gets it? Is it Tanya that... Why are these different? Oh no, are you the one who is incapable of violence? Okay, whatever. Now, do I have a preference who gets what? Um, I could use that on Grange. So we're gonna send Tanya. And I hope it works this way. No, I don't wanna I don't wanna I don't wanna do it that way. Crap. Who can I live without then <laughs> if it's not you? I can live without because I want it to be the people that are the right religion. Warden and handling, could I live without that for a little while? You're the wrong religion. No oh, no, you're the right religion. Hypersensitive, uh It's gotta be Mort. No, it can't be. You need to be researching all the time. It's going to be Grange. Okay, well, this is going to be slightly annoying.
And you got a free holder. Nice. Okay, on this kind of screwball day, let's go ahead and let's take a break. This has been really, really weird so far, so... Yeah. Yeah, did we ever kill that that uh, bad guy that we turned into like... I don't remember what we turned him into. No, we didn't. Or maybe we did. I don't know. Probably fatigue ate him, but let's go ahead and let's take a break. Thanks for watching. See you next time.